Hi guys, um, so we're here in Bellevue Hospital. <laughs> Just want to say thank you and thank you for your prayers and wishes and good vibes. Um, it's been hard for the both of us. <laughs> He really doesn't want to say much, but I just want to say thank you to all, all of you guys. Thank you for everything. Um, we're still here. We don't know when he's going home, but he looks good. I'm just tired. I'm going to go home. You want to show your little legs? You want to show your sneezes? I'm trying. <laughs> um, so, when he's leaving, I would definitely record that, walking out of the hospital, because um, that's what I prayed for the most. Let him be okay. Um, and let him walk out. Or roll out. <laughs> All right, guys. Bye. You want to say bye? Bye. <laughs> He's doing so much better now. I'm very grateful for you guys. Thank you so much. Hey guys, a uh, long time no see. Uh, how you doing? <laughs> um, so I just wanted to give a little uh, update. Because you guys have been asking me and uh, all the followers that I have. I want to keep you guys. Um, it's just been a couple of rough uh, months. Uh, as some of you guys know, I was in the hospital for about a month and a half. Um, I suffered a, a spinal injury. Um, let me try to explain. It. Um, so I had a disc that was uh, expelled out of the spinal cord just enough to uh, tug and hold on to the nerves um, that's created a uh, a paralyzed feeling um, well basically I'm paralyzed from the waist down. Um, I still have a uh, feeling like it's a tingling, dull feeling, um, but it's really hard to uh, walk, stand. For a while there, it was hard for me to breathe, uh, eat. Pretty much everything. Um, I am getting better. I can actually talk without getting out of breath. Um, I did a about a month of physical therapy. Uh, I'm still a long way away from being my old self, but you know, I'm continuing to um, do what I have to do in order to get healthy. Um, the, this channel used to be about um, losing weight uh, it's not anymore it's gonna be about uh, life and how much it takes and how much we take for granted you know I took a lot of things for granted and it ended me up in some serious problems. Um, let me just explain what happened. Um, so about a month and a half ago, um, I was sitting down, and you know what? I let's be let's be completely honest here. Happened about three and a half months ago. Um, 
me and Masi uh, had a, a miscarriage and it put me into a tailspin where I was um, eating so horribly. I basically ate myself right back to where I was before and I probably gained a couple of pounds more than that. Um, so um, from forward I guess uh, to about a month and a half ago um, or two months ago uh, my dog is crazy and he likes to jump onto the sofa and unfortunately he jumped but he slipped and he was going to going to uh, smash his, his little head um, pretty hard um, so everybody knows that's my fur baby <laughs> uh, so I, I reached down as fast as I could and uh, grabbed him and he's not really heavy but you know uh, 20 pounds on an already bad back is like 100 pounds so when I went down I f instantly felt fire up and down my spine um, I sat down for a bit and I was just like okay everything's gonna be okay um, but it wasn't um, I, I almost immediately started feeling numbness down my right leg and I was like uh oh I, I'm in trouble so uh, it just so happens that I live across the street from a hospital uh, thank God um, by the time I got there I was completely numb in both legs now um, that was scary <laughs> but it gets worse um, you guys all know that I'm a big guy so when they went to put me in the MRI machine they dropped me square on my back and then the uh, numbness ran up to my chest and it stood there or well, still there <laughs> um, so made out to breathe and um, I was immediately taken to a uh, An emergency uh, I, I guess a hospital that was more it was better equipped to deal with uh, spinal cord injuries um, and I was you know I had such an ordeal you know it was like went to the emergency room over there in Bellevue Hospital uh, the worst ER on earth uh, they checked me they I did, I did an MRI scan and all this stuff and uh, they were ready to send me home, but I couldn't walk. So I, I told the ER doctor, I was like, sir, you know, you want to send me home, but uh, I can't walk. Yeah, I can't feel anything. And, you know, he, he was like, okay, stand up, let me see. And I couldn't stand up. Like, I was like, dude, you know, I can't stand. So they admitted me, and they found what the problem was, which is what I told you in the beginning. Uh, I was in the hospital for about a month and a half, like I said, and I did physical therapy there, one of the best physical therapy places in New York City. Um, and I can uh, walk with help. Of the uh, the rollator, I call it my my Hummer, uh, but uh, I get around mostly in a wheelchair. Um, it's been quite a change, you know. Um, things that we take for granted. Uh, it's crazy, you know, being able to feel the wind on your legs 
Wasby. Um, I didn't really use the back on my own, which sucks for me because I'm so, uh, that freaks me out to have people have to help me with that. Um, but Mousy does it, so I love her. Thank you so much for everything you've done. Um, you know, I take showers on my own now because I got a nice, nice seat, you know, I, I sit in style. Uh, rolling style too. Um, you know, I'm I'm, I'm up beat. I mean, I have my days like everybody. You know, um, I want to give you know well wishes to to Jenny Coopy. You know, she was she was huge. You know, and she used to talk to me and write to me and all the ladies. Honestly, everybody in the No Excuses Club. I want to give a a loving hug to Sina. I miss you, sis. I hope everything's going good. Um, it's just been it's gonna be a long road, and I'm gonna bring it all to you. I guess uh, the good, bad, and the ugly, and the triumphs, and everything, because I refuse to. Uh, be in a chair for the rest of my life. So, like I said before, this isn't a channel uh, weight loss. This is a channel to gain and regain life. So, I hope you guys are ready. And I missed you guys, and I'm happy to say that I'm back. And I uh, hope you guys are ready. Have a good one. And I want to see you, baby.